So the best way to describe nursing school, a roller coaster. It What's up guys, welcome back to The Right Nurse. In this video, I will be discussing what's it like to be in nursing school. I know this is a question that I do get asked a lot, so I did want to create a video on it. If you would like to know how nursing school is, please continue watching. So, the best way to describe nursing school, a roller coaster. It is a complete roller coaster ride. It has its highs, it has its lows, but in the end, it is totally worth it. However, that's like the best way that I can honestly describe it. So I know starting off, I was really excited, anxious, kind of nervous, but really excited to start nursing school. Like I knew I was going to get all A's or at least A's and B's, you know, I was just ready, pumped, all of the above. I watched other YouTubers to see, you know, their day in the life of nursing, what it was like. I watched other videos um, on nursing school in general, what to expect. All of the above I did. All of the above. It still didn't prepare me. Not at all. Mm -mm. Starting off, you know, it was a lot of information thrown at you. So it was just a lot to take in. But reality didn't hit me until I took the first test and almost fell the first test in nursing school. Like, my old study habits did not cut it for nursing school <laughs> at all. That first test came, I was like, oh, you know, I know this. I thought I had it. Thought I knew, it was, thought I knew what I was doing. And mm -mm, nope, not at all. I barely passed, then the second test came, I failed, and then I was just like, oh, we're not about to fail out of nursing school, like, what the heck is going on here? So, I pretty much had to re, pretty much teach myself how to study for nursing school. See, it's not the same as, like, other courses or other classes, because, you know, in the grade school, high school, whatever, you're taught to kind of basically memorize everything. Questions are fact-based, you either know it or you don't. With nursing school, everything is application. So you can know all the information, but if you don't know how to apply it to like a real life setting or just know how to apply the information in general, you're gonna fail. And that's what happened. The second test, I failed. The third test, I kind of, I basically kind of got my groove and, you know, I talked to my teachers and everything and I got an A. And that was one of the hardest tests. A lot of people failed that test and I was very proud that I got an A on that test. But like I stated, I had to pretty much reprogram my way of thinking and studying because just knowing the information wasn't good enough. I had to know how to apply the information. So that is a big adjustment because I feel like all through grade school, elementary, middle school, high school, you're pretty much taught memorization, know it that way. And then you get to nursing school and they're just like, mm -mm, how do you apply it? So that was definitely like a roller coaster because I, first two tests, mm, third test I got it right then the rest of the semester I was kind of like BC area so yeah to be honest I didn't get like I finally mastered my study habits how I learn how I should study and how to answer these questions this happened for me in the third semester mind you I'm an associates program and there are only four semesters so the first two semesters, I had to find my groove. I was still trying to figure things out. By third semester, I pretty much I had a down pack. I was getting good grades. I was really proud of myself third semester. So it takes time. It, it just takes time trying to figure out how you learn, how to test, how to study. Just it takes time. So don't beat yourself up if you're struggling like the first two semesters. Because I didn't get it right, honestly, until the third semester. Now I'm about to go into my last semester. Now, speaking of tests, since we're talking about studying and all that, let's talk about the test. I did not have anxiety until I started nursing school. Like, none. You know, in college, in, you know, my previous degree, college tests didn't really make me nervous. It's like, I got this. And then nursing school, nursing school came and I was just like, I don't got this. Nope. Like... It's to the point where you just don't know what to expect. You can think you did really well on a test and then you get the test back and you got to see or you barely pass and you're like, where did I go wrong? Like my anxiety <laughs> with tests in nursing school is just like ridiculous because it's just the unknown. Like I said before, you can think you studied and did all the studying you needed to do and then reality comes and you didn't do that well or you barely passed. 
Um, for me, it was definitely a reality check and a humbling experience because um, in previous videos I talked about I have a bachelor's degree in business management. I graduated with 3.8. I, you know, I was A1. Nursing school, you know, I walked in like, oh, I got this. They was like, nope, you tried it. Nursing school humbled me for sure <laughs> because it's, it gets to a point, and I hate to say it, but sometimes you just get to the point where you're just hoping you pass a test. It gets like that. I don't care if you're the best taste test taker in the world. Sometimes it just gets to a point where you're just like, I just pray that I pass. I didn't had a few of those moments. Now, don't get me wrong. Like, you want to get A's and B's. You want to do your best. But sometimes it's just like, Lord, let me just pass this test and keep it moving. <laughs> like, it gets like that. In previous videos, I also talked about how our final exam is 45, 45% of our final grade. So my anxiety is like, for the final. Like, and I say it because, like, third semester, I was sitting pretty in MedSurge 3 with a solid B. It had a B. I took the final, and that thing brought me straight down to a C. It's like, our final can make or break you, so... It's just, a, it's just a lot. Your nerves are bad. Like, I remember the first semester when we had to take our, my first final in nursing school. I didn't sleep the night before. Like, I tossed and turned. I had dreams that I fell, dreams that I passed. Like, it was a hot mess. So, like, the best advice that I can give you guys, honestly, is to study all that you can. Join a study group if possible. Um, practice questions, honestly, is, like, the best thing ever. Practice questions will help you get into the frame of thinking, you know, like a nurse, and it's just great practice. So definitely practice questions. Gotta like talk to yourself and just pray about it and be confident because Lord, it can get to you, okay? Another thing with nursing school that was like, it wasn't hard for me, I kind of got it early, was basically balance. So balancing your family life, your social life, school, work, whatever else you have going on. It can be difficult. I mean, I love doing YouTube videos, but there were times where I just went a couple months or so without doing a YouTube video because I didn't know how to balance it. I didn't learn, honestly. Balancing worked for me during third semester, this past semester on up. Trying to keep up with YouTube, social life, family life was just hard the first two semesters for me. And I did experience nursing school burnout like I was burnt out I just was over it because it was just so much um my second semester me and mental health that course we just clash like clash of the titans we didn't do we didn't get along the clinical part was fine like I did great in clinical um labs and everything were fine it was just the testing and it was the select all that apply tests or questions I should say um, I would do good on all the rest of the tests. Everything else, boom, great. Select on apply, killed me almost every test. And I didn't get it right, honestly, until the final, but that's a whole nother story. If you want to know how that class went, I'll leave the little um, thing up here where you can click on to see how that semester and that course went overall. But just trying to balance everything. Like, burnout is real. I had to like take at least two days. I went to the spa and then I ended up going out on a night on in town with my sister and that really helped bring me back together because I was just over it. I mean, it's a lot. Everything's constantly being thrown at you. Like I stated previously, the anxiety and stress, you know, sometimes you, you just burn out. So my best advice is to schedule some me time, some personal time for yourself because if not, you're going to experience burnout and it's no fun. Like, you just be ready to say, F it. Just, I'm over it. It is what it is. And you don't want to get like that. It's not good for your mental. And it's important just to have time for yourself in general. So, definitely schedule some time for yourself. While it's also, one of the best, I would say this is like definitely a high. Like on the roller coaster, like so this is a high. The people you meet and the friendships that you... Um, build in nursing school is freaking amazing like I have some really cool people some nice girls that I met that I freaking love and I know we're going to be friends after this is all said and done I mean a couple of them have graduated already and we're still friends so 
I definitely know like the friendship you build is so amazing it's fun you guys are going through the struggle together they can relate to you you can vent to them they understand you can study with them and you just build a really solid friendship so that's definitely one of the highs of nursing school is the people you'll meet and the friendships and bonds that you'll create so overall I want to say that's how nursing school is it's just a big ass roller coaster just it's a roller coaster, y'all, but honestly, it's worth it. It's so worth it. Um, coming into my last semester and looking at the friendships I build, how far I have come just, you know, as an adult, as a person, building up skills and all that good stuff and, you know, the knowledge I have learned with nursing and everything, like, it's amazing. I look back and say it was worth it, but two semesters ago, I was just like, what did, it, what did I get myself into? But I kept my eyes on the prize, you know, you see the light at the end of the tunnel and it really is worth it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one.